Hey guys, welcome to 2020. Time for those New Year's resolutions, right? We're gonna make this year our year. Well, maybe not if you ask Nostradamus, though. He had some pretty bad things to say about this year. If you don't know who he was, he was a French philosopher, astrologer, and part-time prophet. While all of his predictions are kind of broad and can be interpreted a lot of different ways, many of them seem to have come true, while others maybe not so much. So let's try to keep an open mind and just have fun with this. This is my first video, so I'm gonna just jump right into it. His first prediction is for World War III. He says that it's going to last 27 years and be heralded in by a comet. In the city of God, two brothers will be torn apart by chaos. The fortress will survive, but a great leader will succumb. He says that the war will begin when the city is burning. Pretty dramatic. To me, this seems like we've heard World War III is coming a lot of times, but maybe he's right. It seems like two superpowers for allies now maybe won't be for too long. Um, City of God, could that be Vatican City? I mean, it would tie into the next prophecy, which is we're going to get a new pope. Yep, current pope is going to die, and we're going to get a younger, more scandalous pope. Is going to lead to a lot of issues between 20 and 29 that will eventually result in the destruction and disappearance of Rome altogether. Could this be the city burning in the first prediction? That's my thought. Brexit also confirmed it's happening. He says, near a great bridge, near a spacious plain, the Great Lion, Britain, right? With imperial forces will cause a falling outside the austere city. Through fear, the gates will be unlocked for him. Uh, could this have something to do with Great Britain leaving the European Union next year? It kind of sounds like it's going to lead to a lot of economical collapse, lots of problems, and doesn't seem to be in a good light. Um, I said something about um, Trump's going to be re-elected. I couldn't find the source, but it's a popular um, prediction of his that he's going to be attempted to be assassinated, elected, and then murdered. So, Trump 2020, I guess? So aside from all of the political turmoil, we're also gonna get a lot of environmental turmoil. There's gonna be a lot of earthquakes, wildfires, and storms like we've never seen before. He says the sky will open up and the land will be burned. Parts of, parts of Antarctica are gonna melt off and sink into the ocean, causing sea levels to rise. Uh, he says there's going to be a massive earthquake in the Westlands. A lot of people are interpreting to mean America. California is kind of the likely culprit here. Um, it's going to sink all of the Westlands. So at least part of America is going to be underwater. He also said there's going to be another 7 to 7.4 earthquake in Turkey. So. However, he did say one good thing was going to happen. Language difference is going to be a thing of the past. He says, after the invention of a new engine, the world will be like before the days of Babel. So everyone's going to understand one another. I think I have heard that they are working on an ear implant device that helps you um, translate different languages automatically. Could this be a sign it's going to go through? This is the only one I'm hoping for. So I guess I'll check in with you at the end of the year and we'll see what happens. Have a good year, guys. Bye.